are these six men doing on the boardwalk? Well, in order to learn the next part of our million dollar formula, you have to pick who will get the most pins from their opponent in five minutes. Think you know? Choose your favorite and let the strong arming begin. While these guys are flexing their fiscal muscles, let's see if you've been keeping your eyes on the million dollar prize. So, which of these guys had the most pins? Woo! All right. Shocked? You shouldn't be. Let's take a look at their winning strategy. So what was the trick? It wasn't a trick at all. These two clever individuals realized they could both win by being collaborators, not competitors, working together to make sure they both had the most pins. This is one of the last pieces in our million dollar formula. Some of the biggest and richest companies in the world have worked together to turn their millions into billions. This company was created when a young inventor with a history of failure joined forces with the Vanderbilts and JP Morgan. Think you know? Though Edison had a bounty of bright ideas when it came to electricity, he lacked the capital to get any of them off the ground. With the financial backing of the Vanderbilts and J.P. Morgan, he created a bright future. A candle maker and a soap maker came together after their father-in-law nudged them to form one large company. It's Procter & Gamble. Their father-in-law pointed out that they were competing for the same raw materials to make candles and soap, so they joined forces and the rest is history. So we've learned that there's more than one path to making a million dollars. Through building your EQ, honing your negotiation skills, thinking outside the box, being adaptable, persistent, and embracing power naps and procrastination, I've shown you new and exciting ways to build your own million dollar formula. So now when I ask you, will you make a million? You can answer. Let it rain. Well, this doesn't let up anytime soon. Sharing. Pass it on. A message from the Foundation for a Better Life.